on our way to Tampa in the E36. Say what up. Now nah, he's a mute. Yesterday I couldn't get him to shut up. Look at the scenery. So what's up everybody? This is day two from the oil change. That rattling you hear in the back, as you can see. Yeah, we make things work. We have S52 exhaust going on one of the E36s that we have. Um, well, we got a grill on the front of the car for the nose panel. Uh, we have a lot of stuff and we're gonna go to another uh, a unit where they sell E36 parts. More parts. Huh? So we're going to another unit that they have more parts. More parts. Which, more parts. More parts, more, more fun. Parts. And we're gonna be picking the hell out of it and stay tuned and Oh, we're gonna record it. We're gonna show you what they have. So we'll see you then. This is the other unit. We here, and we're gonna show you what he got for sale. Yeah. Woo! That's got a what fender. I found him yesterday. A black little that fender. That color, bro, you won't see anything. It's for the E36. You was gonna actually get one. Look at that color. Oh. Sierra Rot. You won't find a coupe. Sierra <laughs> Rot. Look at that color. This is like to the brain and everything. What like regulates it? Jeez. Yeah, when my Sierra Rock nice. got wrecked, I, ha I should have a nicer one. What's this here? He could actually uh, use this. He could use this. This goes to the side skirts. That's on gotcha. this Put this side. Right here with this side skirt. And then this is a new uh, oh, overflow tank. Yep, I got one too. Brand new. Yeah, I knew you said that. BMW, BMW original mud flaps. Is that on the sedan or the coupe? Oh. Airbags. Is that a starter? Mm -hmm. No, that ain't a starter. That's uh, right Something next to the brake piece there and shit. Yeah, that's all brake lines. I like the uh, style 19s. Yeah. Style 19s are nice. That's for the back ashtray. Yep. It's part, of, it's part of the armrest. It's yeah. actually bigger than. Wait. No, it's because it's, it's, no, no, it's, yeah. it's not on it. I was about to say, no way. <laughs> Climate control. AC. Yep. I got those. Those go bad. And the yeah, little one in the I bottom. Mass airflow, not 3.5. Yeah, I ordered one yesterday. If you don't mind, how much did it cost? Pay for the 3.5, uh, 80 bucks. Oh, uh, welcome back again. <laughs> so, uh, I tell wanna, them how we score. Tell them how we score. I want to give a shout out to uh, to Keith, Keith, uh, out here in Florida. Uh -huh. He hooked us up. We went hooked to the public storage. He had a lot of stuff for us there. Like, he, he, He's like just gonna talk right over me. I was just trying to. Anyways, um, as you can see, we picked up tons of parts for our little brother, and for me and for him. Uh, whoever says that you can't put car parts in an E36 M3 and it won't fit, you need a truck. Bullshit. You can make anything fit, realistically. It's just, if you're good at putting pieces together, putting shapes. Let's just say if you're good at Tetris, you can do it. Exactly. And what you see is not all that we got. When you pop open the trunk, we'll show you everything that we got. Definitely. We even got some free stuff, which is crazy. Definitely got you know, like, stuff. It's, it's like the little things, like the bolts, the things that you have to go to BMW specifically to buy, he actually gave to us, which was which was a blessing because when you're in the middle of a project, you might lose a screw or two. I already got a couple loose up here, so. Exactly. And, dude, like, he he looked out. Keith, thank you so much. Appreciate everything you did, brother. Thank you so much, man. And so we're on our way back to uh, Tampa. As you can see, um, we're saying fuck to quarantine. We need car parts. Yeah, so um, we're trying to beat Tampa right now, meaning Tampa has a curfew. What time was it, 9 o'clock? Yeah, Tampa, Tampa passed the curfew. So all businesses and, um, yeah, pretty much all businesses are closed by 9 o'clock. So 
Some say curfew's nine, some say curfew's ten. So we're not trying to find out. We're really just trying to definitely trying to not. beat the traffic, trying to just trying to get there, drop this stuff off. And then um, head home. Yeah. So when we get there, you're gonna see uh my E92 M my E92 uh 335. I almost said M3, because that's what happens when you have too many cars. But you'll see the project that um my little brother's working on. And you see the other E36 that's out there. Exactly. So stay tuned. So, on the way to Tampa. Damn. Holy Holy shit. Who's entering? Mine. <gasps> you. No way. <laughs> I only got. I got both of them. <laughs> I just don't have the side pieces. This is off. This is off limits, though. That's Carlos's. He got the, the, the dang exhaust. Awesome. Now he don't have to have the black one. Nope. Oh, there's more. Oh, of yes. That's yours. Sure mm -hmm. Yep. Christmas came early, didn't it? Yo. Oh, goodness. He found it all. Christmas came early. Just missing one little piece. That's the little side one. On. Say whatever you want. Tell them about your car. All right, guys. So right here we got my old 325 IS. What year is it? It's a 95. 1995. Yes, sir. You want to show them the inside? Sure. All right, in the back seat, uh, back seat is missing, but it's it's inside. It's just... Back seat is missing, man. That's what happens when you live in the hood. Somebody took his seats. Just kidding, just kidding. But it's clean, man. Sweet stick. We don't do that automatic shit. Just kidding. It's nice and clean. All right, I'm going to start mine. Not yet, not yet. I want you to introduce yourself, too. Let them know. Yeah, I got my... What you done to the car so far? It, it's got a Sage 2 supercharger somewhere down in there. It's somewhere yeah. down in there, yeah. yeah. Turbos his intake. Over here. <laughs> Those are his little yeah. shoo -shoo noises. Got a yeah. AFE um, right. intake. Uh-huh. And a 4M3 exhaust. That's, Yo, that's, that's pretty, much, pretty it. much it. And a Turner, Turner chip. Turner chip, not bad, not bad. Awesome. Basically built this motor. We, we took it. We pretty much refreshed the whole motor. We took every single seal out of that motor. Okay. And replaced it. Front main seal, rear main, vanos, valve cover, oil pan. Um, everything. Top to bottom. Everything. Exhaust. Everything. Every every so, single seal we took the little, and replaced. This is the little brother. He's the master mechanic. He's the one that put Frankenstein together. Yeah, so man. we're going to show you the front of the car and we're going to go over what's under the car. Introduce right. yourself, man. My name is Yost. And this is my 325 IS from 94, BMW. But it's no longer a 325 IS. It's a 328 IS because I changed the motor because I blew it up, you know me. Which we will see in a minute because we're gonna turn the car around. Are you gonna give us a co-start? I'm gonna give you a co-start real quick. That way you can hear the big old fucking cams in my V8, you know what I'm saying? His V8. <laughs> <laughs> it really does sound cam, which is pretty cool. Hey. Well, all right. <laughs> you want an E36 content? Here you go. Yeah. Woo! That thing sounds angry. It's uh. Back Turn it off, yo. So, Woo. yeah, what we got is um, it's an M52 motor with the M50 manifold. Not tuned. It's just pretty much we took the bare block and exactly how the M50 came out, we took everything, wiring harness, every single sensor off the M50. We took it off of, we took it off the M50 and put it on this one. Took all the OBD2 sensors off of this and put the OBD1 sensors. And she, she runs like. She runs like a champ? She like definitely a dream, runs, baby. Like a dream? runs real good. Dream. She, she's a ripper. That now. idle, idle's a little mean. Yeah, it's a little rough, uh, but that that's pretty much it. I mean, the top end, you can definitely feel how um, the M50 gives it that top end. Mm -hmm. It'll, it comes in hard at the top end. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah she, 
He's good. So and then M52 B28 swap uh, 325. Look at his little intake right here. Yeah, that's a that's a, that's a breather instead of running it to the bottom of the intake. We just took it, put a K tune, little K tune uh, filter right there, and it fits perfect. Nice. And you know. It's super simple. Everything is deleted in this car. Deleted. You get AC. Uh, you don't deleted. have AC? No AC. Yeah, no AC. Okay. Um, got the windows. You can roll them down. Super, the like, way. super simple engine base. Super easy to work on. And yeah, it's just, that's just, a, you know, <laughs> an intake. Nothing special about that one. You just go tape on it. You want to get as much yeah, cold air as you can get. Yeah. <laughs> little heat shield. Yeah, oh, man. But, so yeah, this car was built. And from the bottom end, from it, the little brother right from here. from nothing to to something. this. This oh, this car was um before this shell. He had a previous shell, which he unfortunately crashed that one. But this Rip. shell was sitting in our um in his backyard for for a little while. Put the light on you. And we pretty much <laughs> pretty much just took. There we we'll go. We, got mm -hmm. that we took this shell that. Was Go ahead. We took the show. Hey, you can fix your hair. There you go. There you go. You nervous? Go we, ahead. Tell him. We uh, we took the shell that was sitting in the backyard, which is this uh, this whole shell. Took everything out of the crashed car and threw it all in this, including interior. So you pieced everything together. Yeah, we, carpet, we, everything. We, everything. We did no absolutely carpet, no everything. Seats, Wiring, no, all nothing. everything. We no okay. dash. Pretty much got nothing. It. it was just wires running through the whole car. Got it here, right? Yep. Damn. Damn. I worked on the interior while they did the engine work. <laughs> nice, nice. So, uh, yeah, man. So this went from a non-running car to a fully running car. I want you guys, Damn, if y'all look at this, follow him on Instagram, Facebook. <laughs> Yo, what? E36. E36. Dios. And E36. And then we got E36. Yos. Dios. Yos. Why? Red, black. There you go. That's right. <laughs> and what's your Instagram? Let them know. All right. Oh, my Instagram is uh, Carlos M3. 201 uh you can follow me on that i'm still building on this so uh you know we uh we all a group we all family we uh, right uh, we build it and we're trying to make something out of nothing instagram is m3 gravity so you're gonna see more projects coming soon you're gonna see a whole bunch of content just stay on the lookout